It's time for this week's Highlander Highlights. In volleyball, the Highlanders produced a balanced attack to down UNC Asheville in four sets and begin Big South play with a win at the Justice Center on Friday night. The Highlanders improved to 9-1 on the year to stay atop the conference standings. It was a four-barrel attack for Radford as junior Stephanie Neese and Mallory McKnight, senior Valerie Gonzalez, and sophomore Macy Keaton combined for 47 of Radford's 54 kills. Then on Saturday, the Highlanders picked up its 10th win of the season in a four-set victory over USC Upstate in Spartanburg, South Carolina. Radford tallied 66 kills and had four players with double-digit kills. Mallory McKnight led all players with 19, with Stephanie Neese not far behind with 18. McKnight hit 707, while Neese hit 533. And Kylie Tuck's first 10 kills all came after the second set. She finished with a 318 hitting percentage. Radford finished with 66 kills in the match, 25 more than the Spartans. Radford will look for their third straight conference road win on Tuesday with a trip to Winthrop for a 7 p.m. first serve. Then on Saturday, the Highlanders will welcome in High Point in a rematch of the 2017 Big South Conference Championship beginning at 4 p.m., and that match can be seen on the Big South Network on ESPN+. And finally, the men's tennis team took the court for the first time in the 2018-19 season this past weekend, competing in the Elon Invitational. Building a young lineup that included three freshmen, the Highlanders posted some really strong results, including a gold singles bracket sweep by redshirt senior Michael Meekers. The Elon Invitational featured five singles brackets and four doubles brackets, spacing out athletes from Radford, James Madison, Appalachian State, Wake Forest, Old Dominion, Charlotte, and UNC Greensboro. Radford's right back at it again next weekend when they head to Lynchburg for the Liberty Invitational. The Liberty-hosted tournament will take place between Friday the 28th and Sunday the 30th at the Cook Tennis Complex. And that's a look at this week's Highlander Highlights. For RadfordAthletics.com, I'm Rick Watson.